All right, guys, so hopefully you have your Pro Tools session brought up. If you don't have Pro Tools with you right now, what I still want you to do, watch this video, take plenty of notes, and apply this as soon as you uh, get the chance to. So what we're, what we're going to be learning right now is something called loop recording, which is extremely handy. Essentially what it is is it gives you the ability to uh, record over and over and over a specific segment of um, music until you get the right take. A, a lot of times what this is also used for is if uh, you have an artist who recorded something, it sounds phenomenal, and then later on it sounds a little sketchy, but then it sounds great. You could just go ahead and re-record that small segment where it didn't sound so perfect, and then uh, have plenty of different options to choose from with loop recording. So what we're gonna do right now is we're gonna go ahead and listen to a little example of uh, you know how this track sounds like, and then uh, I'll explain what I'm gonna do next from there. Okay, so what we just listened to was about uh, 12 measures of music, uh, and then what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and record, or I'm going to go ahead and record uh, myself saying a bunch of hey's and yeahs. Um, at first, what I'm going to do is from measure 5 up until measure 12, I'm just going to say uh, hey just a bunch of times, uh, which is, you know, it's going to be okay. It's, I'm not going to be like really singing it. I'm just going to really be using it for this uh, tutorial purpose. So uh, don't judge me on that. Uh, and then what we're going to do is we're going to replace the haze with yeah somewhere uh, towards the middle or towards the end uh, just to kind of uh, mix up the sound and you know not have it sound so repetitive, which is still going to sound pretty repetitive, but uh, it's just for the purpose of understanding how to use loop recording, of course. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and hit record. Go, I mean, uh, enter, go to the beginning of this track. Okay, uh, we're going to record and enable our transport. We're going to go ahead and record and enable our uh, track right here. And as you can hear, uh, you can hear, you know, a little bit of a delay or ghosting of my voice. Okay, cool. So this means we're pretty much ready. Uh, I'm going to hit play and then from measure five and beyond, I'm just going to say, uh, hey, a bunch of times. Okay. Hey, 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 h
Okay, so as you could tell, the the third take I did differently, or the you know the third take where actually my voice was on the last take, I did differently just so we have something to pick and choose from. Now, as you could tell, I don't know if you really noticed, but these takes have also been included right here in the clips area. So you could definitely see, you know, uh, that I have some new takes, and that's going to be from it looks like right here, I believe, uh, yeah, from right here and below, actually right here, starting at one. Uh, but another way you could do this, it, obviously, first way you could do this is you can go ahead and, you know, grab the clip and then just move it over where you want it. And as you could tell, I didn't do any recording there, so that's, it's pretty much useless. I can go to the second one, uh, and I have Yaz, and let's go ahead and, and hear that. Hey, 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 hey. Hey, 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 yeah, 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 hey, 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 hey. Okay, so as you can as you could tell, uh, now that's something that's available for me to go ahead and mix in there. Um, and also with the clips, is if I wanted to go ahead and just move this, you know, this clip wherever I want, I could obviously uh, layer on top layer on top of another place. But you know, you usually don't want to do that. You just want to go ahead and you know. Uh, put it in the segment that it was originally uh, meant for. Uh, another way that you can go ahead and choose uh, the recording that you want is you can go ahead and right click over it and it'll give you some options to matching alternatives. So right now we already know that we're using the second option but if I wanted to go ahead and quickly uh, you know select the fourth one where I say it kind of differently I could go ahead and do that and uh, let's go ahead and hear how that sounds just from like around Metro 9. Hey, 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 hey. Yeah, 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 yeah. Hey, 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 hey. Okay, so um, that's how loop recording works. It's actually a really great um, alternative to just, you know, trying to re-record an entire sec uh, segment just to get one little part uh, that you want to sound the right way. And it gives you an opportunity to pick and choose different, um, you know, takes to your liking as well. And of course you could even, you know, choose a, you know, if you even like, let's say, you know, take two and you just want to use the first part of that, you can go ahead and then just cut it right there at measure 11 and then use another take and use the tail end of, uh, you know, let's say the third take that you, you use and only use the, the back end of it, or the second half of that. So, I mean, uh, obviously loop recording is a very powerful tool. It definitely gives you plenty more options and I hope you guys use it. Thanks for watching this video. And if you're watching this video and you're not currently enrolled to the Recording Connection, this is only a small taste of what you could be learning in our program. The Recording Connection provides all of our students with industry standard software, like Pro Tools, to take your engineering skills to the next level. We also provide books with excellent lesson plans, a professional studio engineer who will mentor you and show you how to operate real studio equipment, and so much more. With the Recording Connection, getting finance is a breeze. We have many different tuition options, so getting hooked up at a studio near you is fast and easy. For more information, check out www.recordingconnection.com. And of course, I'll catch you guys on the next video.